Greetings to all my fellow citizens and guests from the international community on this glorious day of India's independence. I am glad to address the valedictory ceremony of the fourth HEC KP virtual summit organized by Kerala Police. This significant virtual hackathon clearly illustrates how we should re-engineer the conduct of our business and related activities in the post-COVID times and the global participation and response proved that the decision to go virtual was most suitable. I am informed that this prestigious technology-based initiative was held to help the law enforcement agencies for better technology-driven policing. We live in a knowledge society where no activity is free from the impact of the ever-developing technologies. The increase in technology-based offences calls for equipping the police with innovative solutions to effectively enforce law in the growing digital world. And Hack KP, which saw the collaboration of programs, designers and inventors from across the industry proved to be the ideal platform for this. I am sure that Hack KP has helped Kerala Police to supplement the innovative ideas and knowledge gathered from the three previous editions of Hackathon. The service of trained and techno-savvy police personnel as well as professionals from outside has been utilized to transform these ideas into police-friendly projects. Among many such initiatives which are now being fine-tuned, I was impressed by how global positioning system has been used in the functioning of a handcuff. If a person tries to break the handcuff, a message will automatically alert the police control room so that he can be apprehended immediately. An artificial intelligence based face recognition system which can be used even in large crowds also deserves mention. It will recognize any face from the congregation and analyze the data of any particular person. Kerala Police is also working on an integrated traffic signal system to streamline the traffic. I am happy that all these technologies have evolved from the ideas which emerged in the last three hackathons. My hearty congratulations not just to the three winners of Hack KP, but to all participants numbering 520. I am sure that their innovative and creative ideas will help the police in meeting the digital challenges of the future. In these COVID times, when technology is taking a lead role in all aspects of human lives, initiatives like Hack KP can open doors for innovation, which can help not only the law enforcement agencies, but the human race 
as a whole. I appreciate all the police officers led by Shri Loknath Bahera, Director General of Police, and all the IIT volunteers who have worked behind the success of this unique initiative. Once again, let me convey my heartiest Independence Day wishes to all the participants. Thank you. Jai Hind.